It's a large-scale regeneration project in the whole of the north of Glasgow. It's a very deprived area that the canal comes through. We've worked together with our partners to try and form a framework and a vision for the area. The project's been informed by a series of consultation events, most significantly the initial charrette process. That involved a series of presentations, workshops, art outreach programme. And a charrette is a really intensive four or five day process. Lots of community, lots of organisations, lots of the strategic partners. You start from day one with effectively a blank sheet of paper. You work through a series of sessions and workshops and get to a point where you generally have a consensus. It's always incredibly important to get the local community as involved as possible. It was really, really successful. We had, I think, nearly 300 people through the doors. The impact has been that we've um, been able to leave in, I think, nearly £5 million so far. So we're just about to start on site, and that's creating the core paths and infrastructure and the bridge to cross the canal to link these communities. The Clay Pits was an underutilised green space. I think one of the most successful outcomes of the Charette process was actually getting the designation changed from vacant and derelict land through to a local nature reserve. This is in people's doorsteps. It's wild. It's natural, it is absolutely teeming with wildlife. People are actually seeing change happening on the ground, which again is a really important part of engaging with the community so they, they can see the rewards of their efforts as well.